it's time for another episode of Cookie Butts Story Time! Yay! <laughs> Hi, kids! Galaxy Sky Flish Gamer says, Maybe can you make some sort of weird cat video sometime? Cat face! <laughs> Well, Galaxy Sky Wish Gamer, um, nah, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> Today's story is called Cranky the Greedy Robot. <laughs> Cat had foot like a lady's favorite thing to do is to build robots. But her least favorite thing to do is to fetch water from the well. Ooh, what a chore. So naturally, she decided to build a robot to fetch water for her. So she built Cranky the Robot. <laughs> Cranky the Robot was her best robot so far, and she was really super proud of it. In fact, she was so proud of Cranky the Robot that she even gave him a pair of her most fabulous boots to wear. Cranky the Robot loved his fabulous boots, and he wore them all day, every day, 24-7, 364, son! He took them off one day per year, for religious reasons. Cranky the Robot loved fabulous boots. <laughs> That's what Cranky the Robot would sound like if he could talk, but he doesn't have a mouth. <laughs> well, every evening, Cat Head Foot Legged Lady would have Cranky the Robot fetch her a bucket of delicious water. And when he was done, she would toss a shiny nickel into the well and wish for a perfect tomorrow. <laughs> After 31 and 2 ace years had passed, all Cranky the Robot had ever done was fetch delicious water for Kent and Foot Legged Lady. He loved his job, but not as much as he loved his fabulous boots. <laughs> But by now, his fabulous boots had started to show some slight signs of scuffs. This bothered Cranky the Robot, and he knew he wanted to get his fabulous boots repaired, but he had no money. Then he remembered the cat had foot legged lady had been tossing a shiny nickel into the well for the last 31 and 2 eighths years, every single night. <laughs> that comes out to 570.312 US dollars. All in shiny nickels. <laughs> well, the following Monday, Cat Head Foot Legged Lady went through her usual routine. She guzzled her bucket of delicious water. She tossed her shiny nickel into the well. She wished for a perfect tomorrow and went to Betty Poo for some sleepy time. <laughs> but Cranky the Robot, he stayed up because he had a plan. It would be okay if I grabbed a few shiny nickels to get my fabulous boots repaired. <laughs> Cranky thought to himself. Cranky reached his arm into the well, and although it did short out once it hit the water, he did still manage to pull up a shiny nickel. Cranky the robot felt exhilarated as heck. <laughs> I feel exhilarated as heck. <laughs> loved the way the moonlight glistened off the shiny nickel, bestowing a tiny but brilliant gleam of light against the darkness that surrounded him. <laughs> well, Cranky just had to have more shiny nickels, but since his arm was shorted out, he decided to reach in with his leg. <laughs> his leg shorted out too, but he did manage to get a few more nickels this time. Must have more. <laughs> more nickels for Cranky the Robot. <laughs> So he reached in with his other leg. Zap! <laughs> Cranky the robot must have more nickels! Must reach in too well with him! The moral of the story is... Greed destroys everything! Everything! Lady repaired Cranky the Robot, but now she doesn't trust him to fetch delicious water for her anymore. Now Cranky the Robot has to stay inside and clean Cat Head Foot Legged Lady's litter box. <laughs> There's poop in there. <laughs> oh boy. 
<laughs> the end. <laughs> well, that's it for today, kids. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Oh, and don't forget to hit that notification bell. That way you can find out whenever I upload a cool, fun new video. <laughs> also, if I get enough subscribers, I'll eventually be able to buy my own laptop. Then I can write my stories in public at Starbucks. <laughs>